Hey everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Castle in the Darkness. We're in the castle dungeon, actually, and last time I found the jail key after fighting some sort of martial arts dude, who at first I thought uh, reminded me of uh, Karnov, I guess, although I never played the, any of the games he appears in back in the day. Uh, but it seems like he's actually... I, I actually ended up looking looking up what he's called, and apparently he's based on a character I didn't even know from Double Dragon. Uh, a Bobo or something? Anyway. Uh, yeah, I got the jail key and uh, all these jail cells opened, and this one leads to this very, very dangerous looking passage. Nope. That was definitely not the right time. Okay. Ooh, that was too close. For comfort. Why are there spikes down there? Lost page! Oh, one of the lost pages! I completely... I had completely forgotten about these. Wait. Are you kidding me? Okay. Nope. Wow, that's... That's dangerous. Dangerous to get. Um, I guess I could try... I think I need to try... Uh, um, what's the word? Leaving one of these two platforms intact. That might take a couple of attempts. Ah, uh, well, that's... That's not helping. Hey, we're getting close to 200 deaths. I wonder what I'm gonna unlock. Okay, that... Bouncing off there somehow seems to kill my double jump. That's... Not great. Also, I don't, I don't think I have the timing down. Huh, yeah, that definitely kills my... my double jump. Uh, maybe I can just completely ignore these platforms and jump across them, jump over them. Yeah, okay. Ah, oh, come on, really. Again. Uh, because jumping off, uh, or bouncing off one of those crumbly blocks which is a weird feature to begin with. Completely gets rid of my... Uh, seems to get rid of my double jump. Okay, that wasn't... Correct, and didn't actually unlock anything. For dying 200 times. That's a bit surprising. Nope. Oh! Ooh. Okay. That felt super sketchy. Now it's for the way back. <laughs> okay, spikes, spikes, spikes. <gasps> no! Again! The fucking double jump didn't work. <sighs> That's super annoying. That seems like it shouldn't be a thing. I mean, bouncing there is okay. Oh, wow, somehow my double jump went up that time. That was super sketchy. Okay, let's definitely save that. In fact, how many of those pages do I have? Three out of ten lost pages, holy crap. Hmm. Unlocks doors to the prison cells of the castle. Hmm. Maybe it was just this room full of prison cells. Whoops. We forgot about the enemies. Oh, there's a door here. Um. But then again, 
Maybe not. Oh, enemies die in spikes. I don't know if I've ever seen that before. I guess we're, we're gonna find out eventually. But again, I'm reasonably sure there was a... Uh, There was a door that wanted the jail key. Oh. All right, this is the uh, annoying climb up. Actually, not all that annoying. I mean, instant kill spikes remain instant kill spikes no matter how much hit points or how much hit points, how many hit points I have. But still, everything else kind of loses its um, it's dangerous. Uh, ah, wait, nope. Oh, maybe... Hmm, I thought this looked like uh, something, like a place where you need a key to progress, but I guess not. Huh, maybe I'm, I'm completely crazy and there never was another jail door. But there might be quite a bit... Oh, why couldn't I jump there? Um, in this actual castle proper. Okay, nothing there. Not that I expected there to be something, but... No. Oh, the bees! Hmm. Okay, I'll need to flip these switches again, and... Actually, what's here? here. Huh, one of the uh, paintings. And I have been told about paintings and that sometimes they signify something. They give hints. There's nothing up here? Hmm. Nice. Is there something... Is there some place I want to drop down to, maybe, from uh, that room above? That's what I was wondering there. I don't think I necessarily want to. Whoop. Forgot about that. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay. Awesome. 204 deaths. And counting. Could have fallen there, but no matter. Um, no, I don't remember what's past here. Okay, that's not what I meant to do. I swear, I'm not. I'm not trying to waste everyone's time on purpose. Ah, Krako. <laughs> So far, I've only seen one enemy that used lightning strikes. That was the uh, ghost in the House of Ruth. Oh, that was close. Oh, wait! Did I never make it here? I guess maybe I couldn't have without the double jump. Huh. Oh, and I completely forgot that I... What the hell? Are you... Did your AI break? Um, I feel a little bit bad about this, but then again, it didn't seem like a super difficult boss, even if it hadn't stopped working. Whoops. Huh. Yeah, I guess I couldn't have made this jump here. I barely made it with double jumps, so that makes sense. Huh. 
What's in here? That's the mermaid statue. You can now swim! Ah! Sweet! So sweet. Okay, cool. Not what I expected to find, but then again, what did I expect to find? Uh, I guess it's actually safe to fall right here, huh? Yeah. Nice. Let's take a look at that, just in case it has some, I don't know, neat little description on it. It's a relic, yeah. And I'm still, it looks like I'm still missing a relic from super early on in the game, even before the Ares uh, gauntlet. Hmm. Yeah, mermaid statue. Okay. Doesn't say anything else. Um, I guess I'm gonna keep this magic for now. It's actually not bad. Then again, uh, no, maybe I want something uh, with better reach, better range, better. No, reach was correct. Right. Okay, that was that's cool. So now I can return to the ca cavern of serpents and should be able to um, progress in two different spots than I could before. Do these mobs hurt me? Yeah, okay, they're just normal enemy sprites, except um, immortal looks like. And this wizard guy is. Still weird. I mean, am I supposed to somehow be able to hurt him? <gasps> oh, wait a second. Maybe I am. I don't know if it does me any good. Oh. I don't know why that exploded immediately. But if I can trigger that on purpose... That would be good. There we go. Okay. Now he's dead and it didn't do anything for me. Fair enough. Fair enough. There's a breakable wall that I didn't... Oh, I guess I broke it before and then... Oh yeah, there was wall chicken in there. Gotcha. There's the statue that's gonna shoot over my head. There's this place. I'm pretty sure I got whatever is past there, but I... If I find a safe point... Oh! You can jump on the Goombas! Oh, that's so nice. That's super neat. Um, was there a save point coming up somewhere? Also, oh, you can break through these. Wait, oh, you can? Oh, yes, you can. Oh, okay. Thought I attacked that piece of wall before. <sighs> and there's another painting of praying hands. Well, not another one. There's. A painting of praying hands. Okay. Hmm. But I don't know what that's supposed to signify. That's so 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 nice. Such a nice little reference. One of so many in this great game. Uh. Let's move on for now. I'm pretty sure I... Okay. What's up with this? How many times do you have to hit these? Oh, or maybe you just have to run into them? That's weird. Right. Okay. Um... What was past here? Definitely something up in the other room. There's a save here. That's good. Um, let's backtrack for. Oh, those instant kill. Okay, good. <laughs> it's actually kind of amazing that I never found that out until now. Okay, maybe. I wait for it to go back up, real slow. Now... Well, should probably 
not destroy the blocks I still need to stand on. Hmm, over to the right side there. Doesn't seem like there is anything I'm missing. Yeah, I've definitely been here. Oh yeah, that must have been... I don't know, maybe a key that I needed or something? So that's... that was kind of pointless. I do want to take another look at that uh, gallery of spike ceiling. Although again, I'm pretty sure I got whatever was there to get. Oh, hello projectile. Oh, wow. I tapped the button ever so slightly and still was too much. Now well, it's down here. Two paths. Oh, right. Huh. Dark room. I think I might not... Oh, yeah, there is something. I think I might not have had the uh, double jump when I first came there. Came to that room. So I con concluded that I wasn't able to do anything there. I definitely was here. Hmm. It's amazing how foggy my memory of this place is, actually. I mean, I do remember having seen these places. Oh, 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 wow. So I'm amazed I survived that. Yeah, so I remember seeing most of these places, but... Um, okay, this is not great. Blind jump required? Awesome. Uh, but how they are connected and where I have, where I have been before... Those things... Okay, thankfully no spikes in this room. So it's actually not that bad. Oh god, there's gonna be a boss fight in utter darkness, isn't there? Also, is there something up there? Huh. Strange place. Oh, what? Torture chambers! An entire new area! Oh my god. With awesome new music. 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 This is not at all what I had planned. And that's a blood dripping zombie. Nice. That's okay, it's killable, but it takes a ton of damage. Holy crap. Um. Okay. Ooh. Oh, nice. And that statue over there is gonna spit flames, isn't it? Is. Okay, so I just wait for a short while. Wow, this is a nasty, nasty place. Huh. Save point? Sure. Oh god, I, I just hope there's gonna be some sort of quick way back to the main castle area, because I was not done exploring that place. Did not expect to find a a whole new area down here. Okay. I hope that's not a bad thing. I just did. Maybe it is. Is this just a trap? Can you survive this? Yeah, you can. Okay. It's just a lot more dangerous. Oh, and those instant kill. Holy crap. This area. I mean, I don't see any reason to down there, to begin with. <coughs> except, except you can just bonk your head and... Oh, all of these saws kill you instantly. Sure. I mean, why wouldn't they? Simple spikes do. I already made that one. I guess, I guess it's generally beneficial to try and stay in the upper regions as much as possible. Oh, wait. You're gonna. You're trying to tell me that I need to f be able to fly here to make it across that spike pit to begin with, and then 
I'm gonna probably need the axe to activate that switch. Huh, that's um... I'm gonna take one more look. Oh, well, except I cannot stand on that platform, of course. Um, and survive. So it looks like I might not be able to progress here for the time being. Yeah. The distance is not the problem, but uh, maintaining the necessary height looks like it will be. And it does give me the subtle hint there. It looks more like a, I don't know, a bird with a bat wing, maybe, but I guess it's supposed to be a bird, probably. Or maybe I'm supposed to have my um, bird companion with me. And he might fly up and activate the switch. I think there was a something similar in Castlevania, uh, something of the night maybe, or maybe in, in other games as well, where um, you you'd have a certain companion, like a a familiar little imp that uh, followed you, and and it could oh yeah. There we go. And could activate uh, certain switches for you. Oh boy! Okay. Ooh, this is pretty mean. But... Oh god. Completely messed up my timing there. That, that spike block is traveling pretty quickly, and it looked like uh, there's, there was going to be another, another one of the missing pages. So, um, it's, uh, what's that going to be? The fourth one out of ten? Holy shit! Those things better give me a good reward if I ever manage to find them all, because uh, they're definitely not easy to get. That's for sure. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna the episode here, actually, because it looks like this area might be, uh, might keep me busy for a, quite a while longer. So, uh, as always, I thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment, and I shall see you real soon. Bye-bye.